Hello there. What's going on, guys? Back with another reaction. Today, we're going to be watching DuckTales Season 3, Episode 7. This episode is called The Rumble for Ragnarok. All that I know about it is that it has some kind of lizard monster in it, and it looks like it'll involve wrestling. And it has Ragnarok in the title, so maybe it'll bring in a little bit of Norse mythology. Wouldn't surprise me, given the nature of this show. If you've been watching my reactions, you know my opinion on DuckTales. I absolutely love it. I've really been enjoying Season 3 so far. All these episodes have been really good, so I'm really interested to see what this episode's all about. So, let's just jump in. Threatens to destroy the planet. Uh, I have numerous science-based questions. Unless yeah. the chosen champion of Earth, I am that champion. Ooh! <laughs> I'll have to pass the torch to the next champion of Earth. Which of you will it be? Webby. Huey. Huey. Louis. Webby, you're saving my oh, oh, come on. Right? Dewey is Madden in second Madden. place after Webby yes. if it comes to, you know, like just charging the in and is, uh, physicality. Just because you are the new generation. Also, I don't trust Donald and Della to cooperate on a jigsaw puzzle, much less the fate of the universe. Yeah. Guard yourselves. So, what about just Della? Gritty, solemn launch pad. Fly into that rainbow. <sighs> Ooh, pretty. Such a good theme song, it gets me in every time. Guess Louie knows what Louie's doing today. Uh. <laughs> the ancestral Norse fighting pit. Because it seems like... Oh, it's wrestling! This is awesome! This is awesome! A flashy fight with flamboyant costumes where you get cheered by adoring fans? Oh, I am doing it! What could go wrong? You could be pumped uh. senseless under a two-ton terror while the world literally cracks in two. And they will love me for it. <laughs> Introducing the chairman of the VW. I love Dewey. Beloved underdog, a man stake of the... Ah, nice pair! Look at that! The miser is collecting back taxes! <laughs> Guys, I'm starting to think that Scrooge isn't the good guy here. I watch a lot of wrestling while I fly. Wait, while? That's ridiculous! Uncle Scrooge is the greatest hero of all time! Dips on announcing! Today's spirited match is shaping up to be an enthusiastic... Are you ready to Ragnarok? <laughs> this legendary strong bear. I just watched that know all this stuff. Eh, uh, don't think too hard. What matters is that I'm doing the right thing. <laughs> Give me a hand out. <laughs> I'm the richest duck in the world and you're not. <clears throat> Here we see the use of the cure. Scrooge has saved the world countless times, and your guy is the minion of a giant dragon man. Oh. Do you really look out? Oh. Oh, oh the blasted back. Oh, but it looks like you kids are going to have to take over sooner than I thought. Oh, man. And I don't know where Louis is. He's probably scared and devastated from seeing you get hurt. Get the <sighs> Scrooge gets hit with a chair t-shirt here. Relive chair again as a shirt. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh. Well, smile, be charming, win them over, and win the match, save the world, blah blah blah. blah, 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 blah. So Gotta get your priorities straight, man. Hold. Okay. Jam, pop, you uh... <laughs> well, that backfired quickly. T-shirts against him. I've known you my whole life. I kind of knew how this would play out. <laughs> Friends in front town. Someone called the Bring it down. Bureau. Bring it down. Bring it down. Bring it down. Ooh. We hate you now. Next up, champs tag team partner. Hi, I'm Webby. This will be a tough match, kids. Let's talk strategy. Let Webby do everything. Wing it. Tag, 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 tag. Wait, am I the launch pad here? 
That's like uh, in season two where Dewey said, Oh man, am I the Uncle Donald? You should probably take what she's saying seriously. Your life depends on it! I'm sorry, That's my I'm advice. Screwed. I just... Doing the right thing is not always easy or popular. Not everyone is cut out to be the champion. Oh, of this is why he didn't want Dewey to do it. As soon as you had to take over. Aren't scared of you? It's not me who you should be scared of. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Surprise, folks. The millionaire misers may. I know we're supposed to take over for Scrooge one day, but do you ever wonder if maybe we're not cut out for it? Wonder if that's going to be a theme either this season or next season. Let's do this. I don't know. Let's do this. I'm in. Whoa! In a completely unexpected twist, the announcer was Captain Crash this whole time! What's Jorman Gunner gonna do now? Oh, he did that. That was smart. Your catchphrases are forced! That's just how I do it! Turning himself into the underdog. Scrooge, but why are you whispering? So I can get close and do this! <gasps> What's this? The millionaire miser has turned on his own nephew! Unless Chap Popular thinks <gasps> they can stop me! Ah! Uh. Alright, so that was DuckTales Season 3, Episode 7. I really enjoyed that episode. I like that they gave all the characters something to do. I mean, out of the three triplets, Louie was the one who was just kind of used as a joke, but I like that they gave Dewey and Huey something that they needed to work on. I thought giving the DuckTales characters a chance to do a wrestling episode was really interesting, and it made for a lot of really fun and entertaining sequences. Webby, like, letting her loose in any kind of fight is always hilariously entertaining, and then when Beakley showed up and Launchpad giving his commentary through the entire thing it was just a lot of fun it also maybe hints at and sets up some interesting things that i would like to see explored for example when huey and dewey are talking and they're saying scrooge wants them to take over his legacy someday but they're not sure if they're cut out for it i could definitely see that being a theme that's explored more in this season or uh, in the next season or just whichever one ends up being the last season. I mean, Scrooge has been alive for, you know, 150 years and has kind of set the precedence doing this is his entire life, but they have their own interests. So what if they're just not cut out to take over his legacy? How would he respond to that? What would they do instead? So that could be some really interesting stuff that I would love to see explored some more. And I loved that joke when Huey said, oh man, am I the launch pad? Because it was just like the season two finale where the older cousins were lined up against the triplets and Webby and Dewey looks over and he's like, oh man, am I the Uncle Donald? I, I, I love moments like that. I hope we get more moments like that. So yeah, overall, it was a really fun episode with a lot of really cool moments and it gave the characters a lot of cool stuff to do while also hinting at some interesting things that could be explored down the road. So I'm definitely looking forward to that. But what did you guys think of this episode? What have you thought of season three so far? What's been your favorite episode? Whatever it is, feel free to share your thoughts down below. If this is your first time on my channel, be sure to leave a like and consider subscribing. Also, be sure to check out my other DuckTales videos. It really means a lot. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe and have a great day.